hello guys so today i'm going to show you how to add the bluetooth capability to legacy old amplifier or receiver so today i have a, a mfr receiver which uh, obviously doesn't have a bluetooth capability or it cannot uh, get signal from bluetooth and play itself so what uh, i have done is uh, i've tried to take up power 5 volt power from here as you can see i have soldered red and black wires so basically you have to find uh, anywhere especially inside the power board where you get uh, 5 volt so just have to find where you have 5 volt in the power board then it's just a matter of uh, soldering some uh, power power cables to it so you can find 5 volt in many places uh, inside the amplifier here so i found it right here so it can be checked using a uh, multimeter or so so now once you have the power you just have to buy a cheap uh, bluetooth receiver something like this uh, it's available in the amazon or whatever so this is the wire which i have soldered inside so you can see you have to route it here it goes here and it's, it's connected here so i have power here so you just have to connect power to your receiver and from receiver you get output which you can connect to any of uh, the input analog inputs uh, into your amplifier so you don't you uh, so this uh, saves you by having the additional power supply to your bluetooth receiver you since it's powered directly to your from your amplifier and uh, grounds are all the same ground so both the devices works in the same ground so it's uh, it's pretty uh, simple straightforward and uh, yeah so this is how we can reuse or modernize your legacy old amplifier so if you have a bluetooth uh, receiver if you connect a bluetooth receiver to it so it's pretty much easy nowadays to you know play from any of the devices which can transmit through bluetooth yeah that's all guys thank you